It's uh, coconut based, vegan, dairy free ice, nice cream, not ice cream, but nice cream. Loved it. It tastes just like regular ice cream. You cannot taste the coconut flavor, which is amazing. Just the right hint of tartness, smooth. You don't taste the coconut. The toasted pecan and salted caramel, it's smooth. You can taste the pecan so clearly because the coconut is so mild. I tried the key lime. Bittersweet chocolate. I had the coffee. Cookies and cream. That is like an explosion of flavor. Like you better like like lime if you're gonna have it. And I'm not even a chocolate ice cream person, but it was phenomenal and the key lime blew me away. I it tasted like a key lime pie mixed with like a sherbet from your childhood. Amazing. It's uh, lovely, it's smooth, it's non-dairy, it's like magic. I tried the pecan salted caramel bomb and I almost went to heaven real quick because it was just that delicious. A little little scoop of heaven. Whenever I see she's over here, I was like, okay, I need cookies and cream and I need those toasted pecans. And it's so good. And I'm like a health obsessed person. I am. So I'm also like a very like sweet obsessed person. So she has hit it with like the flavor, but with like the coconut that's like cold pressed, no bleaching, no bad stuff in it. And I can just eat it and feel really good. Go plant based like I did. It will change your life. I just tasted the pecan, which I really love. Um, it's one of my favorite flavors of ice cream, but because I'm lactose intolerant, um, I often can't have regular ice cream and I also tasted the key lime and it like woke me up right when I tasted it and it's a very unique flavor. I didn't think you could actually do that much with coconut. I put it in my mouth and then I had like a food orgasm. I was trying the salted caramel one. Uh, I really enjoyed it because I didn't even go out for uh, like a non-dairy thing but the coconut made it like very uh, creamy. Whereas like most vegan ice creams are kind of icy, but this one like the flavor like really was really smooth. I am exploring to become like vegan. So because I'm cutting out dairy, this made with coconut milk was literally like velvet. Mm -hmm. And I don't have to give up ice cream. I'm so thankful. I have two children, uh, four and six. Of course they love ice cream. Um, and we have a very strong inflammatory reaction to soy and dairy protein. Um, and my husband's celiac, so he can't have anything that um, has gluten in it. Uh, Kube has a really great cookies and cream ice cream that's gluten-free, soy-free, and dairy-free. First time I found something like that. And, and I had um, the coffee and it was and the chocolate too. Yeah, the chocolate too. It was really good. I mean, I had ice cream from all over the place, different countries, and having vegan ice cream like this, man, it was really creamy. Never mind the whole like vegan, non-vegan, just straight up delicious ice cream, and the fact that it's non-dairy, it's even better. Coconut is really good for you, and it tastes really good. And I can't believe it doesn't have dairy. It doesn't? No. I didn't know that. <laughs> I love ice cream and I haven't been able to eat it for years, so finding something like this was awesome. Really happy to find it. Everyone loved it that tasted it, so and it's locally based. And it's nice that it's uh, you know a small family-owned company that's doing this. I really love Kube. Looking forward to seeing it all over. Props to Oakland. Vegan, made out of the coconut base. They're doing it like no one else is doing it right now.